Southwest Atlanta neighbors are coming together, taking a stand against the violence that killed two teenage boys. Yeah, there's now a $50,000 reward to find the person responsible for shooting them. Three boys were shot early Tuesday morning. One of them survived and is still recovering in the hospital. Now the community is rallying around their families. Atlanta News First anchor Tori Cooper joins us live from the Atlanta Police Department headquarters. Tori, grieving mothers are getting some kind of comfort tonight. And they're getting that comfort from their friends, families, and neighbors in the community tonight. They're lifting up these two mothers that are going through an unimaginable loss, Alan. And tonight, they're just hoping that this $50,000 reward will help lead to an arrest. I'm going to let them go, you guys. I was waiting on DJ on FaceTime. It's okay, baby. A mother in our community is trying to stay strong for those she still has left. We love you, baby. We love you, baby. Gonna miss you, baby. On Wednesday, dozens of friends, family, and neighbors gathered on Spark Street in southwest Atlanta to lift up her sons, 13-year-old Jacody and 12-year-old Dontavius Davis. Both teens were shot outside this apartment complex early Tuesday morning alongside their friend, Lamont Freeman, who just turned 13. Lord Jesus, we just ask you for help. We pray, Lord, that you would come quickly that you would help us, that you would bring healing, that you would bring peace to a grief-stricken community. Family and friends say Dontavius and his brother Jacody went to this apartment to wish their friend Lamont a happy birthday. And when all three boys were leaving the apartment, they were met with gunfire. Lamont and Jacody both died in the shooting. It was a joy to have Jacody in our lives, to take him to church with us. Jacody's brother, Dontavius, made it to the hospital where he's now recovering. Police are now offering a $50,000 reward for information leading to an arrest, and mothers in the community are hoping the reward will bring justice. The perpetrator needs to be arrested, but unfortunately money doesn't bring their kids back. Money doesn't take the pain away, um, and money doesn't solve the solution. Now we do have the phone numbers for police on our website right now at atlantanewsfirst.com. And remember, you do not have to share your name. You can leave a tip anonymously. And if that tip leads to an arrest, that $50,000 reward could be yours. Reporting live in downtown Atlanta tonight, I'm Tori Cooper, Atlanta News First. Tori, thank you. Well, right now